<laughs> you already ruined us. <laughs> wow. Good. Please leave the person next to you tell them how awesome this simulation is going to be. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. 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 Take a look. Let us begin. The simulation has everything to do with candy. You're going to be selling me candy. Please pay attention. Drop your pencil. Drop your paper. Pay attention. Good. Joey, please come over here. Take a seat right here, sir. This is your candy. Do not eat it yet. You are my simulation. <laughs> Good. You guys are here. You guys are here. I want you to transform your tables in. So you're next to them, and you follow them. You stay right there. You can read. Ready? And transform in. Help them with the noise. Ready to go. You got to go and sit Good. You two gentlemen, actually, Eli and Eli. Good. Focus in. I just divided you into four market structures. The market structures are you guys are what's called perfect competition. We're going to say these three are what's called monopolistic competition. Those three we're going to call an oligopoly. And what is he? Any ideas? Perfect monopoly. He's going to be a monopoly. Hey, you haven't learned this stuff yet, but you will. Good. <laughs> I'm now going to give you some candy. Good. First things first, let's start over here. You guys, don't, please don't eat the candy. You guys are an oligopoly. I'm giving them, pay attention to the details, the candy. Very important. Tootsie Rolls are right here. Over here are Tootsie Rolls, but they're different kinds of Tootsie Rolls. They're like the vanilla, which tastes like crap, than the uh, fruit roll. Okay, please stay focused with me. Join me for this. Good. The rest of you are also in this simulation, of course. So I want you to please take one of these little candies, Smarties, and pass it back. Take one and pass it back. Take one and pass it back. It was on purple. Oh yeah, purple. Because these all taste completely different. <laughs> <laughs> well, they do. Orange one. Way better. Then that's each one. Again, there's a details here that you want to pay attention to. Details. Good. People who have in the back. That's lightning. People who have them in the back just hold on to it for a second. Please don't eat them. <laughs> They've got a blank piece of paper. Ready and go. Blank piece of paper. Make sure your name has one too. Blank piece. What is that? Gotcha. Can you get one to hear or one to hear? Awesome. Now here's the details, here's what happens. Your format market structure, I'm going to buy candy from each structure. I'm going to buy one from you guys, from this market, I'm going to buy one from that market, one from there, and one from here. I'm going to pay somewhere between 25 cents and 5 cents. I'm going to allow you to come up with whatever price you want to charge. That's it. But think about it before you do anything. Good. Right now on your piece of paper. Okay. Very large, so I can see some from far away. I want you to write down the price, but don't show your neighbor. Before we begin, hold on. Before we begin, now we're going to write it, make sure it's covered. You guys cannot talk to each other. You, on the other hand, the oligopoly, can talk to each other as much as you want. You cannot. Does that make sense? Yeah. But again, perfect competition, monopolist competition, oligopoly, and a monopoly. Good. Some of you guys already think you know what's going to happen. Let's find out. Right now, please write down. Yes, ma'am, what's your question? Yeah. Between 25 cents and 5 cents. You have a question? Are we allowed to talk? Uh, to each other, no. But we can try to get talking. Round two, we'll try to let you talk and see if you can try to find something. And you're buying one from one person in this whole group? Yes. From this whole group in the middle, I'm going to buy one of yours. So put your price strategically, whatever you think the price needs to be. Good question. But right now, please write down your price very large and cover it so no one else can see. Again, I want to be able to see it. Look at the person near you because you're competing with them. Don't show me a number, but give them some sort of scowl or needle eye. Ready to go. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's do these individually. We'll just brief the entire thing afterwards. Good. Right here, perfect competition. Please show me your papers. Let's find out what you're going to sell for. Let's see. There's 10 cents. No way. 12 cents. Not even close. Here's the upside down, dude. 13 cents. No, thank you. 7 cents. That's a little high. 10 cents is a little high. I'm going to go 5 cents. Thank you so much. Thank you, I appreciate that. Pleasure doing business. Shake your hand. 
Done. What I want you to do now is cross out that one on the back side or on the front side if you have room. Do another number. Do it over again. Let's find out. So you uh, it can be the same number, I think it's a good idea. Same question. Same question. Just for competition, you guys stay where you are. Again, I think you should know what's happening. It's just smart. Get the concept. Good. Hold it up. Let's find out. Current competition. Six cents. Still a little high. I'm sorry. I can't do it. Buy that five cents? Done. Gonna buy it for Mike. Thank you so much. You come around. I was walking around. <laughs> Guys, don't, please don't talk. Let's wait to analyze what's happening afterwards. All right, so here, let's find out what they were doing. Good. Hold up your papers nice and big. I'm going to buy it. Just roll 15 cents, 12 cents, and you are, what's that? Five cents. Done. I'm going to buy it. Thank you. I'm doing business. Five cents. Appreciate that. Cool. Was that surprising to anybody? No. No? Yeah. 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 Okay, so he, five cents. Let's find out what happens. We're going to go over there. Hold on, don't show me yet. All right, ready and let's see it. We got, I can't see it. 25, 25, and 25. Okay, good. Are you guys surprised by that? No. No? Okay, uh, who would pick from? Um, pleasure doing business with you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Good, last one. Anybody surprised what's going to happen here? No. All right, let's see. Nice debate. 25 cents. Anybody surprised by that? No. Is that $25? 25 cents. Um, <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Good. Right now, I want you to write every single person write a new number somewhere between twenty-five cents and five cents. Ready and go. Every oh, right, five cents. Hey, this is the camel. This is the camel. You, 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 you don't do it. We're gonna gang up on you. Rise for sure. Twenty-five balls in the face. This is the camel. If you think it's a good idea, don't be greedy and go lower. All right. Here we go. All right, let's find out what's going to happen. Good, come to your paper. Come to your paper. Uh, stand behind, behind them so we can see what I'm doing. Good, let us start with tournament competition. There was an idea out there set by Campbell that you guys set price to 25. Don't you agree? Good, please raise your papers. Let's see. 25, 23. Uh, what you got? Five cents. Five cents. Anybody else be five? Done. Thank you so much. Glad to be doing business. Can you ruin Excellent. Great job. Now, did he ruin it? I don't know. We'll debrief in a second. Let's go over here. Let's see if there's any changes. Ready and go. 25 cents. 25 cents. 25 cents. 25 cents. 24 cents. All right. Let's see what happened over here. Raise them high. 25, 24, 25. Thank you. All right, here we go. And 25 cents over here. Surprising? I don't think so. I want you to transform back to Ray Fast and let's debrief what just happened and why it just happened. Ready and go. Take a look at your problem set. But on the back page, it has a little chart for what we just learned the four market structures. Don't you agree? Please look with me. We're going to fill this thing out together. First things first. Look at the perfect competition. It says control over price. How much control over price? Please raise your hand. Did perfect competition have? Yes, ma'am. None. None. Please write none. So please explain, Nicole, why did it have none? Um, because everyone's going to try and do what's best for them. Like they're all, everyone's trying to sell their own product, so okay. it's not like they can control over what everyone else is putting it as. Good. Now, why? The question though is, why do you have no control? Because he had control and they had control, but why didn't you? Yes. A lot of, a lot of people. The next one, number of sellers, please put many small firms. The reason why you couldn't right, set price is because there was too many firms. Now, I even allowed you, in fact, I wanted to see what would happen with Campbell's idea. Campbell wanted to set prices, right? And people always worried all the time in capitalism. What if firms get together and they set prices? Well, what happens? What happened? What happened? What firm, now do they screw the rest of you over? No. No, you're all trying to screw the consumer over. Right? You're all trying. He's the only person that's providing a service to the consumer that they're willing to pay for, which actually hurts all of you, but he makes a bunch of money. Congratulations to him. I would have done the same exact thing. Didn't screw anybody over. <laughs> Free market system. Yeah. You guys, yeah. But hold on. Is it shady? Weren't what you doing shady? You know what's shady is Campbell said 25, but he put five. Did you really? Yep. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even see that. That's totally shady. That's the best way to win, right? Convince everyone to go high. Yeah, you're shady. You're lying. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Next one types. Go. What can you tell me about those candies? We're on camera. They're delicious. Oh. Uh, I, can, I can take it out. What are we doing? Okay. 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 Okay.
Tell me about the types of goods you were selling in terms of competition. Tell me out. Oh, they're all the same. They are. They are <laughs> Please put for types of goods. They were identical. This type of goods in perfect type of competition are perfect substitutes for each other. We'll do the last one in a second. Let's move on to monopolist competition. The folks who are over here. So what can you tell me about the control over their price? Okay. Uh, they had no control? No. No. They, had no. they had some control. Yeah. They put some control. What well, can you tell me the number of firms? Uh, small. Less. Well, there's only three here, and there were three in the other one. But in this case, the um, number of firms in firm competition is like thousands. This is like hundreds. So I still say many firms, but there, we're talking about right, hundreds as opposed to thousands. And we'll talk about specific examples in a second. We'll talk about the difference. Are they large firms or small firms? They're a little larger than perfect competition. You can see this green kind of spectrum. Good. How about the types of goods they were selling? Were they all the same? Who's over there? What were they? They were all Tootsie Rolls, but they were slightly different. So when you're, please put differentiated or different products. Slightly different. Not identical. All right, now it's time for the oligopoly. How much control of price do they have? A lot. A lot of control. Now, hold on. Not total control. They never did 25 cents. So they did the first round. What happened next round? One of them. Remember? One what of happened? One, one, one of them cheated and lowered their price. So in this case, right, they, they didn't cheat. They cheated on the collusion, on the cartel, which is exactly what I would have done, which we're going to learn in this class. Good. An oligopoly, number or control over price, I'm going to say they have a lot. They have a lot of control over the price. How many firms? Which put few. So instead of perfect competition is a thousand or thousands, but not competition hundreds, this is like ten. Ten firms in an oligopoly. What kind of goods? What did I give them? Same. They were the same, but it really doesn't matter. In this one, please put identical or different. It doesn't really matter. That's not a key feature of an oligopoly. Is that like a cartel? A cartel is an oligopoly, a colluding oligopoly. We're going to jump into that. Last one. Time for Monopoly. We have a person next to you. Tell me what you have to write for Monopoly. So easy? Uh, how much control? How much control? Total control over price. Good. How many firms? One firm. And types of goods? It does matter. Oh, yeah. Big time. Unique. Unique. Thank you. It's unique. It's different than everybody else's, or else it wouldn't be a Monopoly. Right? If it was similar to yours, then you just go sell his stuff. But it's unique, it's different. The last one has to do with barriers to entry. We tried to simulate that concept. There were a few people who stood up and went over to that market. Why? Because you had differentiated products and you probably thought you had more control over price over there, which is very true, right? A little bit more control over price. Would you agree? Yeah, good, okay. So the difference here is, please quote with me, perfect competition and monopoly competition both have low barriers to entry. It's not that hard to be in perfect competition and it's definitely not that hard to be in monopoly competition. But what he said, oligopoly to monopoly. Uh, high barriers to entry. Very difficult to become a monopoly. But how do I know it's difficult to become a monopoly? Because well, there's not very many of them. One, it's illegal, depending on what kind of monopoly it is. And number two, there's only one. Well, why there's else? Not how very do you know? No experience. There's not very there's many of them. Yeah, them. or else you see monopolies all over the place. Right? Monopolies would be all over the place if it was easy to become one. It's not, because the government tries is to Is Microsoft the monopoly? We're going to talk about that in class. I'm glad, I'm glad you're going exactly where we're going. Is what I'm Microsoft? Good, I want you to be the person next to me again. Tell them how awesome that simulation was. Right? <laughs> 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 